let's use an elliptical marquee tool. Right? I'm, I'm always thinking about tips and ideas and things that you need to keep in mind. If you've ever used an elliptical marquee tool, let's say that I want to make a circle selection around this person's eye. Right? I want to do something inside of here. More often than not, what you'll do is you'll drag something, and I want to do a selection around the eye. You're going to click and drag, and you're like, oh, I, I missed it. Oh, okay, drag, oh, no, missed it, missed it. Nope, that sucks, nope. And you'll spend a lot of time doing that stuff. Right? Here's a quick way for you to be able to get rid of that. I'm going to do a selection right here, because I clearly have missed it, if it, that's not his eye. I'm going to click and drag. Now, I'm not going to let the mouse go. What I'm going to do is I'm going to keep the mouse held there. And I'm going to use my finger, and I'm going to hit the space bar. As I hold that space bar, watch what happens. I can move the selection around and move it into an area that I want it. The moment that I do that, I can let go of the, ma let go of the space bar, but don't let go of the mouse. I can continue to draw. Space bar, move, let it go, drag. Space bar, move, let it go, drag. So you can get it exactly where you need it, and then let it go and get the selection around it. Once you're done, you let it go when you're done. So sometimes that's a little bit of a time saver.